everybody, welcome back to Pit People. Uh, this time we're going to do some more of the world map stuff. There's four quests. I know what two of them are. Oh goodness, let's do that again. Um, but this one up here is the Botanic Hill Gardens, which we did really early on, I think, actually. Uh, this is See It Go. This is a thing called Galactic Realms. I don't know if we've done this before. It's a four-star fortress mission? Uh, mission? Core Ma Galactic Realms. The Core Master won't let anyone beat his high score. Show him who's boss. I will, in fact, game. Show him who's boss. You can bring your friends to meet your house at any time. Thank you. Speckled horse. Yeah, I don't think we've done this. Dude, help! The Core Master is protecting his high score again! Don't worry, we're here. Now, what's the situation again? What's his name? Fartleby? It's the Core Master. We can't even compete with him. Oh, well. We tried catapults yet? Oh, or trebuchets. Those are good too. What? No, no. I just mean you won't let anyone else play the game. Oh, well, did you put your quarter on the thing? Yes, he didn't care at all. Wow. I know. The player wanted to try and beat his high score, but... I'm doing it. I'm really doing it. Game over. Oh. Ha 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 ha. Man, he's invincible so long as he's got that high score. So you need help kicking him out? By the way, we've brought the, uh, I think it's like C team, but it's my backup team, because I, the main team is a little bit too strong. So you need help kicking him out? Sure, but when I say he's invincible, I mean it. Get in front of that machine beat his score, then take him on. And don't forget to grab a couple of quarters first. Oh, so we actually have to grab two quarters? Or is there more? Oh, he's got mortars in there, too. Wait, is that an elite enemy I see? Bullet buggy. Let's just be able to see that. Ah, because I normally just do this. So he's got, what, a couple of elite enemies in here? So I have to get quarters and go into here. He's elite. So he's got a bunch of elite guys with him. Ski ball. Oh, Galactic Realms. This, I wonder if it's like an arcade thing. And also, am I supposed to keep you alive? Or what's going on with the targeting reticle right there? It says it shouldn't hit me there. Farlby is with you. Oh, good. He actually dodged it. So right now, I need to go. I'm not going to worry about. I should just get two gnomes. Gnomes are super weak. Probably he's gonna get his butt kicked. Vampire against vampire. Perham, you go that way, you go that way, you go that way, and you go this way. <coughs> yeah. Who level up? Is that Leviathan? Yogurt's almost dead. We wanna get rid of these first. Yeah, they're gonna spawn someone next. That's always the mistake I make, is trying to go for the objective. And ignoring the tents. So many people start going that way. Perham definitely needs to go that. Oh, that's not Perham. That's Perham down here. You can go after that tent. And you can go after him. Everyone's moved. Very good. Everyone's out of range. We're. The guy that's supposed to be helping me. Oh, you're there. Has he only been hit the once? Aw, oh, you stunned me. I hate you. Send you that way. Same with you. Yeah, tent needs to go down. You need to go down. If I get rid of the mortars, that'd be perfect. Is he sending... I can't tell if both mortars are firing or if they're firing in alternating turns. I don't like you. I was trying to destroy that. You know what? Who's that again? Is that Yosa? It's Eurasio. I need you to get rid of that goblin. You all ignore the, the cannoneers and the guys being spawned by the tents. We need you to destroy the tents. See? What's his name? Party? Is that what his name is? Patty. 
Her name, I guess. Patty is the name. I need you out of there. You come around here. You over there. And sorry, skeleton, but you're about to get shot. I'm gonna do. Oh, look, Patty died. At least skeleton just got hit. Oh, he's got. They've got an archer now. Did say it's firing twice? Who else is firing at me? Oh, it must be these guys on the other side that are firing at me now. Hmm. I think that explosion. Yeah, there you go. Okay, Leviathan Perham, need to get out. You missed Skeletonius. You're a terrible shot, apparently. Oh, they're destroying their own tents. Oh, good. One of the tents is gone. And we need to get rid of the goblin, this tent, and the three guys remaining after that. The only problem with this team is it doesn't have a healer, but it means it's got a little bit more damage than my main team. Which is why I prefer to take them. Actually, no. This team is probably not nearly as good for these types of missions. Strict. No? What am I doing? I still need... Well, I thought you can go around there, just to make sure the tent dies. Perfect. Now that they can't spawn anything from this side anymore. I wonder if I have to... Did I pick up... I haven't picked up the quarters yet. I probably have to pick up the quarters before the doors open. Something happening? Are these guys triggering? Okay. Sure you're gonna go over there, you're gonna go over there. Yeah, I'll get the tokens once I've cleared out the enemy team. But since they're hitting their own allies right now. Both mortars on this side are gone. At least until I decide to man them. Uh Skeletonius, you stay here. You guys, Perham, I'm gonna send you down to go get the token. You are gonna be poised to sit over there. And you both are going to go after this guy. Just to remove him. Yep, okay. All their their allies are gone. Except for this guy. This guy's moony. Yeah, it has to be these guys still firing. Looks like I have to get the tokens in order for the door to open. What are we doing? I don't want to get him in melee range. I want him to get him right there. Start moving you guys up here. Okay, got the quarters. Let's take down that gate. We will, Captain Leviathan. Oh, it means the gate's attackable now. Skeletonius. Can you actually fire at one of the mortars? No. You can fire over there, though. Don't know why it says it's dangerous over there. Not even gonna bother getting anywhere near that, other than right there. Perham, you guys move. I haven't been forgetting anybody, have I? Nope. Perfect. Oh! You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna drag this out unnecessarily. Just keep firing at that guy over there. They're not spawning any more enemies. Oh, I forgot this guy's probably going to keep trying to break the gate. It's going to take him a while, though, to break the gate. Uh, especially if they keep trying to break the gate. If I keep hitting him, I can try to kill him before I even get in there. Keep you per him over there. You fire it there. It's almost dead. 
And my goal here is just because they're inactive right now, is to just try to kill off Andrew over there. He might end up destroying the gate. He did. No, that means he'll probably activate and start moving around. Dang it. Give them no quarter. Really? Give them no quarter? And he just barely missed. Wish I had known that, you know, I could have fired at that guy. Wait, do they actually have the mortar guy leave? Unless there's two tents I'll definitely want to get rid of. Because what's the, uh... Objective. Get to the game. Now the core master, yeah, so let's just get to the game over here. Hit one person. Fartleby. Send you way over there. Really hoping that this means that some of them will start coming towards me. Thank you, Quartermaster. He's not invincible. He's got like 15 health. He's got like 100 health or so. Maybe it means he can't be permanently killed? I feel like the question lied to me and said that he's literally invincible. Invincible usually means they don't take damage. This maybe it means... Oh, of course he's going to move out of the way. I don't have to save him. Did I hit anybody? You're just going to fire right there. You are... The tent already activated. That's not good. That He's up and about. Uh, Captain Leviathan will get hit if I do that. I certainly can't let my vampire get hit because he's super weak to fire. Everyone just do this. I wonder if it makes him not elite by doing this. Maybe because he didn't stay stay in there for player one start. Play for three turns. Okay, so I just have to keep Perham safe until then. Actually. You're aiming to be over there. I want you there. I want you still here. I want you to move over and attack. Just because I want this guy. Yeah, there you go. You're dead. Thank you for moving directly into the line of fire, Quartermaster. Yeah, they're going to try to kill the guy standing in there. Just beat the first mini boss. Oh, is he. I think he's he's trying to go for the um uh what do you call it the mortar over here from the looks of it there he's just an archer and is standing suspiciously close to it but he's probably gonna go for the mortar now yeah he has unfortunately no one moved within range last level I mean Spurham will survive. You gotta keep forgetting your ratio is range, so I don't want in melee. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, he's stunned. Uh, but he'll get out of stun this turn. <laughs> oh, I forgot they explode. 51, 120 damage. They're all, they're both moving in range of that shot. I did eat my initials, Quartermaster. What? No, I'm not invincible anymore. Get him. I wonder if he was me, you know, unkillable before. Like, if you got him down low, he would have just been like, ha, you can't kill me. 
Wait, I would love to get that, um... What do you call them? Um, Goblin, I think is what they are. Gnome. That's what they're called. They're called gnomes. I should have remembered that. It's been a hot minute since I played, though. Ow! He's been stunned, though. And I wonder, does anything happen if he manages to get back in here? Like, does he become invulnerable again? We won't find out, though, because he's going to die very, very shortly. I kind of want to risk... You know what? Since you're going to be firing, let's go right there. Per ham, even if he dies, it'll have been well worth it. He shouldn't die, though. Where'd my extra, all my extra lives go? Mission done. Yay, now we can play too. No more high score protection here. You, you, you maxed out the machine. I'm coming with you to learn your ways. Oh, did I get him on my team now? Okay, so you get him on my team. Leave my stuff. I don't need to fight them all. Oh, there was many left. I think it's the first time I've actually ever tried that. Okay. Bear. Whatever. Go back to town and see what our goodies were. Although since the last time I played, they added a bunch of new achievements. They added, like, one to do two missions in one outing. I'm not going to do that. That's something like I do one of the, like, two escort missions in a row. And it's like 500 kills mountain can't get around that 500 kills I probably have close to that combined game will tell me once I get back into town let's look at our progression um, I have almost everything every location unlocked I'm missing 21 quests and a metric ton of unlocks. Probably because I'm not capturing a lot of things, nor am I fighting everything out in the wild to get the unlocks. I'm just... I'll get them... I'll be getting all the quest-specific ones right now. Um, da -dum -dum -dum. Fartleby has joined our team. We've got Freeze and Awe. Court Seder, the butler, tambourine, and a bunch of gold. Galactic Realms, a new high score! No, that's how many people we have. I have over a thousand kills, but they're not, it's not retroactive, so. Do I make doubles? I do. What was the button to sell? X? Yes. Need to do a quick search through equipment. I already have Ancient Blade. Go for thrown weapons. I already have a Crispotron. I already have a Tambourine. I already have ICU. I already have Violence. Ha ha ha. Socket shooter, tech support. Why is tech support poison? What sense does that make? I guess because it's like a support weapon. I don't know. Game's logic sometimes is flawed, but it's funny flawed usually. Oh, get rid of the butler. Extra. Oh, Quartz Zeta, I think, is one of the higher or, or bigger tier ones. Yes, it is. I really want to get Queenie and... Uh, was it Rookie and Queen... Or was it Chester? Yeah, Chester and Queen, Queenie from the chess event. I keep calling chess event like this is World of Warcraft. What's that? September 3rd. If you're attending, please stop by our booth. Say hello. What is this?
Okay. Must be a upcoming event. Probably EGX. We have lots of gold, even though I've been spending it. So we're all... So, if I remember correctly, we're all kept on this because I started the, my videos at this part. The Walking on Sunshine, I believe. Just keep me posted, which we haven't even started again. And then Attack on the Firemen. I have a healing camp. When did I use a healing camp? In Nitro. Let's go out and explore a little bit more. Before we call it a day. I want to at least know what the other mission that's in the desert is, because... Let's see, F1... There's one all the way in the desert, the bottom right. No problem left. Direction, Snick. <coughs> I apologize. Oh, yeah, we're... We've done a lot of the missions in the game, and they're not all done yet, I know that. Was that, is that Santa? Yeah, we already did that one. I did that one on camera because that's where we got, uh, was it Sub Santa? I think that's what he was called, Sub Santa. The underwater Santa. Yeah, the minecarts for whatever reason. I guess this would be like a transportation method for the... Oh, I don't know if I've done this one down here before. There's a few that I've done before and failed at. I forget... Oh, I'm on the A-team again. I was like, Laura, groomer has it. Help a young beardsmith with his witch... Oh, beardsmith? What? It is witch problem. Stanley Yarn. Hey, you guys. I think I screwed up. I sold my collection of beard trimmings to a witch. That doesn't sound so bad. The witch part, I mean. Collecting hair is pretty creepy. Oh, is it? Well, I'm a barber now, so it's all fine. Um, I see. So, what do you think the witch is doing with the hair? What do you think? Witch stuff! No. Now I'm too scared to go back to my barber's chair. Well, there's only one way to find out. Follow us, Stanley! Is it an escort mission? Am I getting attacked along the way? Of course, he's like right next door to this. Oh, no. I can't remember which quest that is. I know I've done it before because I have 100%. I don't know what says 100%. I think 100% just means you've completed it previously. Oh no. Yeah, maybe there's a percentile on them, but I usually get 5 stars anyways. Because the game's not very stringent on how you get 5 stars or not. You can lose half your team and still get 5 stars. Let's see. This is a 4 star mission, but this is my 5 star team. Who's beaten the final mission before. Oh no, what's that? you guys it's just wolf fight master stanley hi wolf back so soon i think i think there might be a problem oh can i capture the witch oh curses hagatha curses yes good guess stanley <laughs> i brewed that hair you sold me into a potion your best but customers have become my loyal beardos. That's really weirdos. Beardos. It's time to prove your worth. Remember, there's always some br more brew if you need boost. Oh. Tune to see how you're doing. It's against the barber's code to fight someone you've groomed. Really, Stanley? Sorry about this. You're not sorry. That cauldron has to go, doesn't it? Otherwise, they probably keep healing themselves or buffing themselves. Again, I keep forgetting to do this. Yeah, it's a target. Optional, destroy the cauldron. They say optional. I mean, it's probably mandatory. Also, he's probably unique. Wolf fight master. Chugsworth. Spiffy bristle brush. Buff Manderson. I feel like they're all special. Bullwhip. No, not jaw squarely. They all sound like they're supposed. To. They're unique. Let's fight our way this way, guys. You need to protect gluten, I forget this all the time. Sophia, you can stand there. Gluten, can you go in the middle? Yep. There we go. You can fight whoever comes near. Yeah, that's a mushroom I just forgot. Do I have anybody that's super vulnerable to poison? No. Don't even dare hit gluten. Yeah, you can fight him. You... 
Go down there. You go down there. You come fight him off. He's been slowed, and he's been, like, damaged down to, like, half health. I definitely would want the witch. I assume the witch comes back if you destroy the brew, or if you kill them all. Or maybe she keeps bringing more in. I don't know. Something has to do with the brew, because it wouldn't give me an optional objective if it wasn't something possibly important. Like, um, what was it? The cannibal one we did way back? Where if you didn't destroy the projector, then they kept healing up. Which I think... Yeah, that was an op optional objective. It was to just, you could win it without, but unless you had lots of damage on the guys, they just healed up way too much. Because I think... Yeah, I remember the guy I was trying to capture was a um, cupcake. One of them's going back to drink more brew. Who? Why is one of them like super injured? He is. I was if I just surround him to the point where he can't move. <laughs> Unless maybe it's one of those things where oh, look. he's not going anywhere anytime soon. Who? I don't know who I just killed. Go away with your stupid mushroom. Mushrooms are a pain in the butt. Wait, did more than one of them die? Luton, go hide in the corner. Is, is he wearing a helmet that actually gives him armor? I didn't think that would actually give armor. Okay, you're... You can't move. He's gonna get over to the brew. So it's when they get low health, they start to try to run over to the brew. I assume they ignore you as much as possible. I definitely want the witch if she comes back. So we've got Sophia here who can help capture guys. Kimmy, he's a spiffy bristle brush. I just want the witch because she looks cool and I like the uh, headwear she wears. Oh, that was... Well, you poisoned your own guy for one thing. You start being on that. I really hope I didn't make a bad decision by leaving him all the way out there. Yeah, I think I recaptured him. Am I going to get a thing about, hey, attacking... Or sh I think she should appear if you start hurting the cauldron. It makes sense. I'm destroying her cauldron. I didn't even bother like looking around the place. It's just a barber's place. I still don't know what that is. Is that one of the cats from Battle Block Theater? I know this takes place in the same universe. But, which is what we discovered at the end. Spoilers. For those who didn't watch that video yet. I don't know why you haven't. But, yes, the these two, both this game and Battleblock Theater share the same universe. Yeah, she, uh, I'm back. Did you miss me? You bumbling beardo. Stanley's friends are still alive. I know you can do better than that. Hagatha, stop. What did Stanley do to deserve this? Was he the one that did that to your hair? <laughs> like I let anyone try to pretty me out. Look, dearie, you see this whole situation right here? I mean, your face? That's right, you think this was an accident? I don't, I don't let anyone tell this lady how to look. Oh, that's actually pretty inspiring. Kind of like a role model, except evil. The evil witchcraft's just a hobby, dear. Give me beauty tips and I'll destroy you. Ha 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 ha. Haha, yes. Pip? I mean, boo. But not really, you're awesome. Pip, stop sympathizing with the bad guy. I definitely want Hagatha. What? Turn him into a frogged friend. Did you just turn one of us into a frog? My fingers were itching for some bewitching. Is that a permanent thing? Or is it a temporary thing? I really hope it's temporary. Let's finish off Stanley's um, former customers. Need you to go down here and you go up there. <coughs> We know we have the damage necessary to kill them off before they get over there. 
Yeah, you can try to run over there. Yeah, I don't have anybody super vulnerable this time to fire. Technically, they all take damage from fire, but... I mean, anybody that's going to take increased damage from fire. Oh, you're back, Horatio. I really hope this doesn't end the mission when I destroy it. Is she going to get over there and try to bewitch me, or... Oh, it's her range thing that bewitches people. Maybe? Or maybe it's a unique thing. Because I assume she's a unique. Everyone get over here and try to take out Jaw Squarely. Yeah, I know you're going to try to run away. Who are you? Wolf Fightmaster? Killed one off. That leaves Wolf Fightmaster and Hagatha in the cauldron. She's not going to comment on that, or is she just going to try to keep trying to beat her issue up? Okay, is that a guaranteed thing when she hits you? My goal here is just to try to capture Hagatha, not to kill her. Because she's cool and she's unique. Wolf is apparently... I think it's... Low health is what the bleeding means, even though I think there's a bleed status in this game. I think that's what, um, vamp vampires, vampiris can put on you. I don't know what the plural of that is. Vampiris, this is. I'm really hoping that she doesn't disappear right afterward. Good. We just frogged them anyways. No, the cauldron has to go. Stop Hagatha. Is this still an optional objective? Doesn't look like it. Did you just try to hurt him while he was a frog? How dare you? For the I thought the cauldron was destroyed. Come on, destroy it. Oh, can it not be attacked anymore? Because he refused to attack that there. Oh, it turns into a mascot that can still attack? How much of an ADF be to let, allow something like that to attack you? Stop with the frogging. It's not still attackable. I wonder if she tries to retreat to it. Cannot capture her? So I just have to beat her up enough. Yeah, you can stay over there. <laughs> it still buffs them. Still acts like a mascot. Oh good, Gluten's full health. Or was full health until, you know, had to heal people. Stop attacking the person you frogged. Why can't I capture you? Really should have stopped that. I'm going to try to get over here and attack. Don't you dare kill her. Yeah, you can't attack the cauldron anymore. Wonder what happens if you get her low. Ooh, maybe if you don't destroy the cauldron, you can capture her. Fine, I'll tell you when my witchery isn't want. I can tell when my witchery isn't wanted. Wait, Hagatha, didn't you say that evil witchcraft is just a hobby? Or er, uh, yes, that gives me an idea. Wow, wait, is that just cat string? Close. It's something new I invented. Had so much hair, I started rolling it into balls like this. I call it yarn. You know, like my name. Oh yeah, that was one of the tooltips, wasn't it? It was created by Stanley Yarn, and I think that's who it was created by in real life. I was thinking people would make stuff out of it. Wagons. What? Okay, those first two are impossible. 
Second one, more likely. Why? I can make all kinds of things with this. My grandkids would just love some socks or ugly sweaters. Finally, something to do when my cauldron's bubbling. Heh <laughs> thanks, Stanley. I guess I'll just let you off easy. Let Hag get to leave? No! We still want to fight, dearie? Find me. Old habits die hard anyway. Yay, I can capture her now. Come on, Haggatha, get in here. I just don't... I don't want to send anyone in. No, I'm just going to let her get close to me. While I heal up. Is that enough for... her to get in range? Perfect. Thank you, Haggatha. You're mine now. Is anyone going to say anything about it? No. Nope. You're mine, Hagatha. I think you guys deserve a kiss on the lips. No, thank you, Bear. I like that mission though. The mission was fun. Uh, I'm not going that way. Did everyone ended up with almost still full health. I'm not doing see it go. I wonder if I got her broom as a weapon. Is that? Well, let's back this way. Can I find people who run over on the way back? Yes. Eh, eh, it got stuck. I've discovered everything on this map, so that means there's no... I think the one location I've left is probably one of the secret areas. I wonder if secret areas appear twice. What is that? Pizza. Oh, I, I did pizza with the resistance before. That was be one of the delivery ones. You just deliver it to somewhere. And then, you know... Let's see. Oh, you have Stanley Yarn and Hagatha. And Stanley's Finest. And the butler again. And a thick brick. Groomer has it. Yarn. They'll never catch on. I know, right? Where are they in the thing? Oh, look. Hagatha. See, she has six kills. Do I have a team to put them on? I want a team of, like, all my uniques. No, I don't want you, Jerkamese. I want Hagatha. Stanley Yarn. What? Where did I get Nagatha from? This is one of the other episodes I did that. It's been a while, guys. Fartleby. Lorraine. Okay, puppy person. Hmm. Oh, General Rush a lot. You know it's the sun. Prevention and starch. Oh, I've got Brosif as well. Oh, I've got a lot. Scrumptious, Red Velvet, Noir. Oh, I just realized his name. Film Noir. Okay, game. I I I will say I didn't get that at first. Lysandra. Where when did I, why did I get Lysandra? I think I just caught her because I needed it. Yeah, let's have Hagatha and Nagatha. And. Red Velvet. What weapon are you using? She's using Apple a day. There. I don't need two of Stanley's Finest. I don't need two of Honor Roll. Oh, I've also got two of Important. Wait, who's using the... Oh, Broken Bottle is what Lorraine's using. What are you using for a main weapon, Lorraine? Trusty Machete. And what hairstyle are you using? I have a double there for flower power. So I'm just scrolling through them. I think this. I'll try, probably try to level this team a little bit. Oh, I've got the Pilgrim and Cowl of Quiet. I forgot. I mean, that's a, bar, a bear burr shop. Oh, I don't have a hero. It's, the hero obviously has to be Hagatha. Or is it Lorraine? No, it's Lorraine. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, leave a like, comment, subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. Goodbye!